shop to the chapel. is an interesting one because the chapel can actually take up quite a bit of space. So I don't know how I want to satisfy a spiritual need. Because I kind of want the center bit to be classroom and the library. I could use this small area, the chapel, but if I remember correctly, the chapel also has a limit here. Six by six. Uh, for full planning, um, despite my objections, if I do two by two everywhere, I can actually get a pretty decent sized chapel here. So that would be. 8 by 12, so I could make that work. Because then I can do. What is it? Pews. Pews. Um, could also. Because I know it's 3 by 2. Do something like this, and that would be the middle. Oh, even that's still not the middle. Jesus, criminy. Okay, so no matter what way I do it, this isn't symmetrical. The way I like. So, if I just... Now I put the altar here. Do I want the altar? This, I think, will look better. And then I just draw out some cues here. And then some prayer mats. Like so. up here. I can make that work. And, uh, just to verify, because I'm still not positive on this, the altar is 3 by 2 That's exactly what I thought. Alter can be rotated. Sorry, my throat seems a little scruffy. Just give me a moment here, I might be able to correct that. Just grab me uh, water here. That might be a little bit better. There we go. here instead of here. Do you 
Let's hear one in the back. And then prayer mats. Here and here. There we go, that, that, that works. And then, in terms of the pathway, whoops, we would just move it over to, to here. There we go. There's our chapel. There's our chapel. Now, that puts it close to visitation and infirmary. Now, I could put another entrance down here if that would seem to fit. But, I want this to be freely accessible. So, I will probably leave that the way it is. So, now we've got the chapel. So, that to me, for anyone who's, uh, not been, uh, who anyone else has been following along, means I could probably start building. Now, I'm used to having a lot more money than I have now. So, I can't go crazy on it. But, I could start some of the... Start with the administration center because that just will fit the best and will be our first power station. Yeah. Now, if I remember, oh, and that's right, this is staff room. Now, all this is kind of kind of open. So, let's go to materials. Get a brick wall to start off here. Okay, that's definitely not working because I need foundations. Got foundations. The question is do I want this whole thing inside? Or just this bit? And I think I want just this bit. So, foundation wise. Go like this. Um, get some objects. Do staff tours. Here, 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 here. Can't do that yet. the rest of the workers on the fencing because I need this to be secured so then we we'll just go up and around like this and bring it down it's a lot of fence I'm gonna stop. And then I'll let the workers proceed with the deliveries. We'll basically have fence here. fence because all this will be encased in fence as well. We can use a staff door here and here.
because I have a little bit of space. I'm going to go ahead and encase this because I know these are all going to need to be offices to begin with. Correctly, I actually don't have a storage room, so I should have thought about that for building. But the storage room can go there. I normally have it, or I could have a, a section here off the chapel for storage. If I do the section here after the chapel, <clears throat> that would make a decent sized storage room, actually. Yeah, 8 5 I think that's actually pretty decent sized storage, considering. Um, and then we would just have. Entrance down here. Why not? That, that could work because I can still then do classroom and library right next to each other here. So the next big thing that I'm going to do here um, will be this area, so I always like to do my cell blocks in concrete so it can get expensive. Um, I'll need, all this space for shower, it's a good $10,000. Um, and then all this space. So for holding cell. And then we'll do regular fencing here. for the shower. So that covers the holding, uh, it covers the holding cell, the shower, the yard. So that would then mean I need kitchen and canteen next. Um, so I've still got $30,000, that's good. Um, foundations. I kind of want to put the kitchen in brick. Yeah, I'll do that. That's going to be $12,000. That's half my money. And then we can do objects, staff, a door here, jail door here, and here. And then for the most part, we'll focus on those areas um, with what I have left. Oh, look at this long line of trucks. Alright, so now this is where I, I jump in, take my delivery zone, uh, stretch it here as well.
So now, because I did that, I emptied up this poor little truck. that now. So this little driver here needs to move these uh, to the open spaces over here. Almost exactly what I want them to do, but I miscalculated right here. Okay, so that's been built. This will be built. That's being built. The office desk. in a corner because that's what file cabinets get done. Those are my two offices. high encoding
fumbling around with that fence. cell goes right here and then we need the shower which will be right here Yard, which goes here. Oh look, two offices and a yard already done. So now, let us hire Mr. Warden. Democracy of Finance. Security only because I want to try to get some of this done, and then health will be the next um, one I actually get. So, health and psychology. I'm gonna go ahead and get a jump start on health as well. Now, I'll keep the order a little bit busy. Leaves me with eight thousand dollars to um, fill in. So let me start with the holding cell because that seems like an easy thing to do. Get bench to go here, here. A toilet. I know these are gonna have nasty blimps that will annoy me. Beds in here. And the reason I put beds in here is because um, the holding cells have become more common uh, with uh, grading cells because if a prisoner doesn't have the correct grade, he would be put in the holding cell until one of a correct grade would be given to him. Cover the holding cell, the yard, even though it seems mean, I'll just leave it open um, because it's already checked off. The shower.
plan in here. Thirty is the maximum for water piping. Let me just double check that, because I think it's either thirty.